What a location to win the biggest prize in strongman sport. On the banks of the Zambezi, time for just one last Herculean effort. Well, how about this as a climax to World's Strongest Man? Neither of these two men, I feel, have got a chance of lifting the title. But we've got Phil Fister, the giant All American the who now Please holds the world Phil record Fister. for this event, up against Magnus Samuelsson, a former champion, two the brilliant the competitors. Champion, Magnus Samuelsson. The Atlas Stones record could go this time around, and more importantly for Magnus here, he could actually move into second place overall if he does five in around about 30 seconds. But it's Fister who gets away first. Samuelsson is flying. Oh, brilliant. That's two up, well inside the target time. Samuelson is going like a train. This is phenomenal. Everybody watching the clock. This is fantastic. The last one, 165 kilos, 25 stones. He's done it. The first man ever to go under 30 seconds. And that could have improved his place, improved his prize money, and improved his pride. Phil Fister came through strongly in the second half of the overall competition. A very fine performance by the American, but what a performance by this man. But that was a fantastic way to finish. Yeah, I like to go out with, my, with the Swedish flag high. Because for me and Sven and Jan and some other guys, we are so, so equal when it comes to pure strength. So the guy with the best luck will the guy with the less mistake will win, and uh, I, will, I think he, Sven will win this. And he deserved it. He, he had a fantastic competition. He's been good the whole year. And uh, sometimes you just have to accept that it wasn't my day. And uh, all congratulations to Sven. Next year? It's always next year. Well, this is the moment that Sven Carson has been waiting for. We reckon if he does four stones in around about 33 seconds, he's done it. Janni Virtanen, I feel, about to lose his title. What is it about these Scandinavians? Absolutely incredible performers. And it's Scandinavia all the way. Sven Carlsen, he was a former world record holder of this event. He hasn't got off to the best start. He's seen his record absolutely destroyed by Samuelsson. Virtanen fighting every inch of the way. He's still the world's strongest man, but I fear only for a few seconds longer. Carlson, easy. Two more to go. He's just got to get one more stone up. We're watching Vertanen, but any moment now we'll see the new world's strongest man. There it goes. It's inside the target time. He's done it. Vertanen has lost his title. Carlson going for number five. The cream on top of the jam. He doesn't have to do it, but I think he wanted to do it. Any moment now. Well, the stone's not going to go up on the wall, but he is. Yuka Ahala, former World's Strongest Man, gives him a little pat on the head and says, my friend, you've done it. You've done it. Third two years ago. Second last year, now the champion. The world's strongest man for 2001 from Norway, Sven Carlsen. Well, five years earlier, Sven Carlsen had been leading the way in the competition in Las Vegas, only to be injured. He came back two years afterwards, finished in third place, was second in Sun City, and now the moment of triumph for the man who's immensely popular amongst all his fellow competitors. And he's finally achieved what he always thought was his destiny.